Hey everybody, in this video I'm going to be talking about rake knitting, also known as double knitting. Um, I'm not showing you how to do the stitches, I'm just talking about why you skip the pegs. That is the number one question I get on my YouTube channel. Why do you skip pegs? Why do you skip pegs? Why do you skip pegs? Um, if I didn't respond to your question, there's one of two reasons why. Uh, I either didn't respond because the question got overlooked. I do get a lot of comments on my YouTube channel and some of them get sent to different areas and I just I don't catch all of them. Or you ask the question on a video where it is actually answered in the video description or it is answered in the video. So I want to think about that. But here is the answer for everybody else. Let me anchor the yarn here. When you are rake knitting, first of all, let's look at the loom. We're going to use this one for an example because this one actually comes with the pegs already marked. It's from Cindy Wood Loom. Uh, the black topped ones are to mark a different stitch. Think about the dynamics of a loom. Okay, the pegs are evenly spaced all the way around the loom. So that means this inside curve here is going to have less pegs than this outside curve because there's more space on this outside curve than the inside curve. So what you have to do is you have to skip pegs to keep it even. All right, if you do not skip pegs, this happens. It's like, all right, it's, it's looking okay so far. But watch what happens. See the stitches start stretching out. And it gets to where you cannot wrap the entire peg because there are not... First of all, you're going to be end up doing this. Nobody wants that. It's just going to be a huge mess. There. So you guys can see. That is why you skip pegs. You skip pegs because there are more pegs on the outside than the inside because everything is evenly spaced. Any questions or comments, leave them in the comment section below. If it's an actual question that has not been answered, email me. My email is in the description below. I don't miss my emails. I do miss some comments. I do miss some questions that are left on the videos, but I get my emails. So, I hope this answered the question for everybody that has been asking. Um, direct link to this video will be in every single one of my S Loom videos. So, if you ask this question and I do not answer it, that is why. Um, <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching, and I do hope this was informative. 